Coolers are great for heaps of things. You can use them to keep stuff cold, keep stuff hot, to play basketball. But you know what? They're not great at being nearby when it's time for another beverage. Like a situation I had the other day. There I was, ready to settle in for an afternoon of not having to bring people things with my legs. And then my situation changed. But I thought, it's okay, I'm a creative guy. I can work around this. But there was something about gravity or something. I had an idea. It was simple, deliver cold beers by drone. Just grab a cold beer, tape it to the landing gear of a drone and send it on its way. It was a complete success, but this got me thinking. What if coolers could fly? But what if coolers could fly? We're out. No worries. Presenting the Cooler Drone. It includes everything you've come to expect in a cooler, like being blue, having a lid, and is a cooler, or whichever generic brand name your country uses. Plus, it includes everything you'd expect in a drone, like flying. Proximity to a sufficient supply of beer is solved, minus the pain in the back of moving a heavy cooler about. For example, traditionally on construction sites, cooler backing is the only way someone can carry a cooler up multiple storeys to make sure the workers have a sufficient supply of beers to get them through the afternoon lull. Tomorrow, tomorrow or something? Oh, yeah, nice. No more. The cooler drone isn't just for when you need a beer now and a supplies out of reach, but for when it's too hard to bring a cooler at all and you know you'll need a beer soon. Like when you're going for a run. Just turn on the remote and in the cooler drone app, select need beer soon mode. The cooler drone will happily follow autonomously with a ready supply of ice cold beverages. Not only that, but it will also provide mobile shade while fanning you on a hot day. Plus give some subtle persuasion when you're a bit off the pace. Or it can be used if you see someone else and they just look thirsty.
But it's not only when you're on foot that the logistics of taking a cooler can be an issue. Previously, when you're heading out camping, you'd always have to do this. But no more. You just need to select the beers on arrival function. Like a faithful dog, the cooler drone chases behind, landing at your destination. But what do you do if there's nowhere to land? Like if you're weirdly small boat fishing. Yes, the cooler drone has boat mode. It can follow along while fishing, meet you in the middle of the pool because you're too slack to swim to the edge for another beer, or use it to serve snacks to those who aren't too worried about the threat of throat lacerations or a bad haircut. Putting the movement of beers around aside, it's all well and good while your beer is kept cold in the insulated protection of a cooler, but what happens after that? You know what happens? It gets hot from the sun and your hand, your big, dumb, hot, warm hand. That's what happens. <sighs> Not anymore. Just drop the built-in snorkel into a nearby water body or its own internal ice melt and keep things cool. Dropping the ambient temperature significantly, the misting spray keeps your beer cold and maybe slightly watered down. Oh yeah, and there's one last thing. It has a bottle opener. Okay, so truth be told, the cooler drone currently may not be able to lift quite as many beverages as I've suggested it does. Turns out the parts to lift 45 kilos, which is about 100 pounds, is kind of expensive. So currently, instead of two cartons, it's more like two cans or one stubby and a handful of cashews. But hey, that's all you need when you spend your entire summer holiday building a cooler that flies. What went wrong in my life? This is more of a, a, a proof of concept. I'm just proving that it's an awesome concept. You'll be able to check out a link to the build video here when it's edited and uploaded. And also the same for a uh, behind the scenes and blooper reel. I'm Craig Turner. My YouTube channel is Turner81. Make sure you subscribe to catch my next video. Catch you in the next video. Hi. <laughs> That was great! <laughs>